How y'all doing? You know the vibes. Yo, who am I? I go by J. I ain't on no savage shit. Free JT, I am that bitch, but I am not your bitch. I still pop my lips, still snap. Yeah. You know the vibes. So before I get into this video, I do have a YouTube promo for you. Please help me subscribe and support my friend. Her YouTube channel is Serena's Life. She currently has 123 subs, you guys. Um, she is no stranger when it comes to my YouTube channel or any of my social media platform, period, because she follows me on everything. She definitely pulled up when I had my uh, meet and greet in like DC, Maryland area. So I definitely appreciate you. I actually popped up to her job. Because she was like, Jay, I'm not going to make... She wasn't able to make the meet and greet, but I was literally in the same building as her. But she was like somewhere else working. So I was like, girl, don't worry about it. I'm coming to your job. So please, you guys. It would make me so happy and it would definitely make her day if you can just help her reach 500 subscribers. If you want to go over and beyond, help her reach her first 1,000 subscribers. Now it's 32,000 over here. I know for a business that a thousand of you guys are going to click on this video and watch this before you go to bed. So please click the link that's going to be pinned in my comment section. Also the link to her YouTube channel will be in my description. Make sure you follow her on Instagram and Twitter. I will put those links in the description as well. Just to let you know what Serena's Life YouTube channel is all about. She will be doing blogs, story time, clothing hauls, challenges, and pranks. And baby girl can dance too, so she didn't even tell you, but baby girl be twerking that ass on TikTok. Big period. Yes, I told on you, Pooh. I wish you the best of luck on your channel and in life. I know that you were about to move and some more stuff, girl. And I just wish you the best. You know what I'm saying? You know the support over here is 100 and it's real. I love you and I love you guys. And I want you to get back to the video because I know, I know. But enjoy the video. Peace. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on, J Squad? Plum Squad is your girl, J. You already know. Welcome back to J Vibes, where there's a whole lot of great vibes going on. Big period. I miss the fuck out of you guys. No cap, no lie. This video, you guys, is just going to be an updated video on what's new, what's been going on, and Whatever else I just want to rant about. What's new? The only thing that's new with me is this nose piercing. Yeah. I was literally just in a state of mind where it was like, yo, I need something different. I need something new. I need something different. And I needed pain. I don't know why I get in those moments where I be needing pain. That's kind of like how all my tattoos came about. And whatever piercings I do have or did have, I be needing something new. And I be needing pain. So... I was like, uh, okay, I was like fucking around with the fuck around, and I seen like this little jewel somewhere, I don't know where it was at, and I had placed it on my nose, and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so cute, so I didn't want to take away from my mole, so I didn't put it on the same side of my mole, I put it on this side, and then when I get there, the lady is like, oh, you should get two, maybe three, and I'm like, baby, please, let me just get one, now, that like I was really nervous when I got there but I knew I wanted it so I got at the tattoo shop I had anxiety and I didn't even know like I had anxiety that bad I was basically like, prolonging the whole situation so the number one thing that kept bothering me she kept saying okay you ready and I said stop asking me that I said don't ask me that again I said when I close my eyes that's when you go and then I lean my head back and so my eyes kind of look closed but they wasn't closed and then I kind of set up and I was like let me look at the needle and I looked at the needle and that's what also made my anxiety bad because the needle was like this thick the needle was like this thick and I'm like yo 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 why is the needle so thick when the piercing isn't that thick at all and she had so much lube on it it threw me off but anywho that's the only thing that's about new with me and that's just on um, big period now what's been going on like why have i been missing i'm not gonna lie i haven't been really motivated uh with so much stuff that's been going on in the world like you guys we done lost so many lives um That itself, you know what I'm saying, deserves a moment of silence. But us as American people, us as a black community, black women, sheesh. I didn't want to say the wrong thing. Um, but I have been using my platforms, you know what I'm saying, to voice my opinion on certain situations. I just like never made like a dedicated video to it because to me, it's bigger than that. Like a lot of 
other people were using their platforms because they felt obligated to or maybe one of their supporters made them feel, feel like they had to yeah i don't feel like i gotta do nothing explain nothing for nobody to nothing to nothing for nothing okay since last time i've been on youtube i could say i have way more self-love self-worth and appreciating self thyself by thyself for thyself do you understand what i'm saying when i'm speaking to myself okay now it's nothing wrong with you know just sometimes taking some time you know for yourself to yourself or to yourself for yourself however you want to put it it's never too late to be dealing with something and then not be dealing with it again if that makes any sense i know it's a lot of like jay what the fuck are you talking about at the end of the day i'm blessed I'm super blessed, I'm happy, and I really don't have no complaints. I'm planning a lot of stuff, and I'm just trying to stay focused on that. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not trying to limit myself to just one thing. And my biggest thing right now is balance, because I, like I said, I'm in so much stuff. I just need to balance it all. Like, I had 24 hours, just like everybody else has 24 hours. And it's all about how you use your 24 hours. Maybe I should have did a Q&A for you guys, but... When I do a Q&A for y'all, ooh, you be reaching, honey. You be asking about the stars and the moon, and I'm only the plant. I can't tell you about the moon when I'm the plant. No? Okay. I want to play a song for you. Now, I'm going to say that. What are priority things looking like for me right now? I don't even know if I asked myself that question correctly, but answer it. Okay. Priority... For real, for you guys, is God, like, he's been number one priority through any situation I'm in. It doesn't matter if I'm up. It doesn't matter if I'm down. You know, my relationship with God is, like, number one. And it's crazy because I recently was put into a situation where I had nothing but time and opportunity to have conversations with God. If you follow me on Instagram, you've probably been hearing me say a lot. Let me ask Jesus and let me talk to God. Because I literally, on camera, off camera, on live, off of live, I literally... Talk to him. Second is myself. Like, I'm starting to really, really, like, dig deep into what I want to tolerate, what I don't want to tolerate. It's a lot of stuff that I don't want to even deal with. It's a lot of stuff that I dealt with. It's a lot of stuff that I did. Dealt. What? It's a lot of stuff that got dealt with that ain't getting dealt with again. And it's a lot of stuff that, you know, I was putting too much of me in it or not enough of me in too much of whatever and it's like okay bitch I, this ain't for you no more you know how something start off as being for you but then it gets taken over and then it's like it's not even you i don't have an example but yeah um so god me and then whatever else wants to fall in line after that ain't none of my business but whatever is after me better be you know what i'm saying damn near close to me does that make any sense don't know if I'm making any sense right now. Like I said, I am just ranting you guys. If you do want to like ask me some questions so we can do an updated, a real updated QA, um, put your comments down below underneath this video, you guys. Please make sure you are liking these videos. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Share my content, you guys. Be engaged with the videos and put your comments down below. Make sure you click the links in my description and follow me on all of my social media. Um platforms because it's lit like i've been talking way more shit on twitter it's ridiculous and let me just say this i'm i'm just too fucking much um if you're not fucking me if you're not paying my bills don't you ever in your life fix your lip to ask me what am i doing why did i post that don't ask me shit don't ask me nothing because let me tell you something 10 times out of 10 i'm not even gonna say 10 i'm gonna give it like an 8.3075 mm -hmm. so an 8.3075 out of 10 i'll be like reciting lyrics you guys some of y'all be like yo what's wrong ain't shit wrong with me and if it was something wrong with me i don't even think you guys would even be able to tell because the way Aquariuses are set up we, do, we just don't put our feelings out there for y'all to read, judge, laugh at, and not really give a fuck about, okay? And I just feel like, I don't know, I'm set up different. I know, I know, I know, I know. I be trying to tell y'all I'm a water sign. Y'all be like, no, Aquarius is an air sign. 
I'm set up different. I'm not like these other Aquariuses. I'm not. We might have some things in common, but that bitch ain't me. I'm not talking like, oh my god. I'm not talking like specifically a specific bitch. I'm just saying them hoes ain't me. Period. If you in the Aquarius food chain, you hoes ain't me. I love y'all, but y'all ain't me. I'm the ringleader in this Okay. Some of y'all is crazy. Some of y'all is crazy and set up really differently, but um, if you yourself, you know, are working on anything or I don't know, you know, you feel stuck or like the first step to anything is just doing it. Okay, you wanna know how many times I thought about doing a YouTube video? So many times. I literally, <sighs> mm, 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 mm. you don't even wanna know. I have like three, four whiteboards that has YouTube shit on it. I have plenty of index cards that have YouTube shit on it. I have plenty of journals, plenty of journals with YouTube shit in, it, shit in it. And I just like, I wasn't, I wasn't there. You know what I'm saying? But the first step to anything is just to do it. So, you know, today I ghetto fired my ring light. It's looking real motherfucking good on the other side of this camera. And um, I sat in front and I was like, oh, I look like a bad bitch. And I was like, just instantly motivated. And not only that, I miss you guys. And um, I, I do want to say, although I've been absent, you guys, on YouTube, I've been very consistent on other platforms that I have. And with that being said, I've been getting new subscribers. So, hi you guys. Welcome to all the new subscribers and thank you so much for coming and subscribing to my channel. Although you probably was like, "Yo, she ain't got a new content since a month ago. What the fuck going on?" And I try to give you I try to give y'all that, you know what I'm saying, freestyle just to hold y'all over until I come back. Y'all was still like, Jay, where the fuck you at? Um, but I just want to say thank you so much, you know, just for your endless support. It actually makes me emotional. Emotional. It makes me emotional because, like... <laughs> Bitch, I'm not crying! Not yet, anyway. I'm trying to say the words. Um, but not nah, like... Some of you guys have been with me since day one. Oh my goodness. Some, like, I'm talking about day one. When I wasn't, when I didn't even have my own channel. A lot of you guys have been with me since I started my own channel. A lot of you guys have been with me since the beginning of this year. A lot of you guys just been with me. I'm just trusting my process and trusting my journey as you guys should. No matter what, your, what journey you're on right now. It could be a fitness journey. It could be a journey to, you know, gain your first 1,000 subs, your first 5,000 subs. It can be a journey to start your new business. It can be on a journey to anything. Just trust your own process. I really, you guys, don't have anything else to rant about. I think I've rented it all out. Okay? I do want to play your song. But before I play this song, please make sure you are subscribed. Get someone new to subscribe to my channel today. Like, comment, share all that good stuff. Click the links in my description. I miss you guys. More videos on the way. You know what I'm talking about. Um, whole lot of great vibes going on, big period. How did I get this? It was a warm, sunny, hot, humid morning. Long day that turned into night, but... My friend was moving out from her mom's house into her new apartment. I'm cleaning out the closet and I find this and I'm like, ooh, what are you gonna do with this? And she's like She's like, I ain't gonna do shit with it, Pooh. I'm like, you don't give this shit the fuck to me. I said I can hang this on the wall. Sad thing is it never made it on the wall. It's literally it's sitting on the floor, leaning up against the wall. I was thinking more of like decorating the wall with the guitar. I'ma figure it out. Anywho, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Look for more videos coming and I'm gonna just, you know, slide on out. I'ma tune myself on out. Just focus on you, baby girl. <laughs> J-Vibes, you know the vibes, you know the fuck going on. And I'm out this bitch. Yeah.
You know the vibes. It's Jay. <laughs> <laughs>